On this problem, we're asked to determine if the following sequence is arithmetic, geometric, or neither. In an arithmetic sequence, we add a constant to each term. So I'm going to write plus c. So each term is found by adding a constant. In a geometric sequence, we find the next term by multiplying by a constant, which I'll call b. If it's neither, it just doesn't do one of those two things consistently. So from negative 7 to negative 3, I see you're adding 4, because negative 7 plus 4 is negative 3. Also, negative 3 plus 4 equals 1, and 1 plus 4 equals 5. So this one, since we're adding the constant 4 to each term to get the next term, it's arithmetic. On this next one, from negative 64 to negative 16 is plus 48. But from negative 16 to negative 4 is not plus 48. So this one can't be arithmetic. Let's see if it's geometric. Negative 64 divided by 4 is negative 16. And negative 16 divided by 4 is negative 4. And negative 4 divided by 4 is negative 1. So actually, if you divide each of these terms by 4, you get the next term. But another way of saying divided by 4 is multiplying by 1 fourth. So negative 64 times a fourth is negative 16. Then negative 16 times a fourth is negative 4. And negative 4 times a fourth is negative 1. So this is geometric. On the next one, 1 plus negative 1 is 0, but plus another negative 1 wouldn't get you a positive 1. And furthermore, 1 plus a negative 1 doesn't get you a 4 or a 9. Um, so it's not arithmetic. Let's see if it's geometric. 1 times 0 is 0, so 0 times 0 does not equal 1, and that doesn't equal 4. This is neither. Since there's not a constant that can be added or multiplied to each term to find the next term. Let's look at the next one. 0 plus 2 is 2. 2 plus 2 is 4. Okay, so it appears that each term is increasing by 2. So this one is arithmetic. Arithmetic. 